Hello guys, this is only Abi doang and today I'm going to be doing a slightly different video. So there's been some news going around recently regarding a new live simulation game that might be an excellent alternative to The Sims. It all started on Twitter. If you're using Twitter frequently, you might have encountered this video from a guy showing a footage of a window being resized and moved smoothly like it's a piece of cake. There's also this footage of a curtain being placed there as well. The tweet kinda blew up a bit and it gained so much attraction, including myself. So, as I look into it more, this guy called Alex Massey, uh, I'm sorry if I pronounce it incorrectly, is actually developing a new indie game called Paralives. And it turns out that this game is heavily inspired by, you guessed it, The Sims, with live simulation as its main genre. There's also a video shared by him showing a dog in action as well which pretty much confirms that pets will be included in the game as well. The newest video shared by Alex shows more footage of the game, specifically the build mode. Yeah, from this footage alone, you can see some more details such as the grass, the beach, and you can also see a car and a tire swing as well. As you can see here, you can create curved walls, split levels, multi-directional walls, and you can even see the fluidity of the stair placement. Anyway, this game also has its own website. Let's check the website out, shall we? Okay, we're here. So, introducing Paralives, an indie live simulation game. And the definition for this game is, Paralives is an upcoming live simulation indie game. Build your dream house, create some characters, and manage their lives the way you want. The game is currently in development and will be released on Steam for PC and Mac. Yeah, so we're going to have a live simulation game but it's made by an indie game developer. And I'm in love with this game already because in my experience, most of indie devs are one of the most consumer-centric game developers and they're very passionate about their projects. Okay, let's scroll through. Created by and for the community. See, this is what I'm talking about. The developer has a Discord channel dedicated for this game. Inside, you can even give some ideas and suggestions for the game features in the server. A lot of people right now have already poured their ideas here and even the developer himself is very responsive and always active in the server itself. It's a really good sign if a developer is trying to keep in touch constantly with his community. You can check the website itself if you want to enter the Discord server or from the description of this video. Okay, and let's see the features it'll offer. Ooh, they even have screenshots of the game and they look gorgeous. Okay, it seems that they'll have some kind of like a fleshed out build mode with gridless constructions, curved walls, resizable objects, split level floors, custom shaped stairs, full color or texture customization, and much much more. So that sounds like good news for the architect type of players. And then of course it offers the live simulation and turns out that it'll be an open world game. Wow, this sounds amazing already in my opinion. You can also focus on your career, love life, friends, family, children, or the town's community and well-being. And since this game will be an open world game, you can freely explore the venues such as restaurants, parks, beach, etc. And yes, cars and bikes will be available in this game as well, guys. Oh, and here we see some of the screenshots such as a house, a ship, and this venue near a beach or a river, I think. First of all, I really like the art style the developer is going for here. It feels so vibrant and cartoony as well and it really reminds me of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild in a way. Okay, let's explore the website more. So obviously, it's still at an early stage of development, so there isn't any release date for now which is fully understandable. And since it's still at an early stage, some stuff and features that I said before might change in the future as well. It'll also be available on Steam. It'll support mods and custom contents with the Steam Workshop, which is extremely useful. This game is also a one-time purchase and the developer stated that after it got released, some new features are still going to be provided in free updates. Oh, you can also contribute to the developer directly as well through Patreon. Personally, I've become a patron of this game myself because I have high hopes for this game and I really want to support the developer throughout this project. If you support him through Patreon, you'll also get some exclusive sneak peeks such as screenshots and videos regarding the upcoming features of the game and you can partake on community polls as well. I'll also put his Patreon page in the description down below. Also, Peril Lives has his own YouTube channel as well. Currently, there are two videos available and they're the videos that we had seen in the developer's Twitter earlier. All links to the game's YouTube channel, Twitter, and website will be available in the description of this video below. So yeah, that is Paralives. 
Personally, I'm really looking forward to this project because The Sims itself has been like, uh, how do you say it? The monopoly of the live simulation genre in the market right now and I really, really want to try with a fresh take of the genre from other perspectives, especially from an indie developer. As of now, we've only been seeing the house building aspects of the game and we haven't seen some other details such as how the people look in this game or how they live their life, so maybe it'll be revealed in the future for that aspect of the game. If you want to keep in touch regarding the game development progress, all links related to Paralives will be available in the description. So how about you? What do you think of this new game project? Tell me about your opinion of it in the comments down below. Thank you so much guys for watching this video and see you later!